the scumbags getting out of the vans, look. You're supposed to be out of the vans all the time. You're not supposed to be sitting in there. You should know better. Alfie, you should know better. I thought you was going to find a proper job, you told me. So you're another lying scumbag then. Eh? Alfie, you lied to me. Now, don't call me mate when you lie to me. You lied to me. Don't call me mate, Elfie, you're not my mate. You're one of those, Elfie. You lied. You said you wasn't doing it anymore. You're going to find yourself a decent job. Put your camera on, mate. Don't forget you're supposed to tell me. I'm just turning it on. Yeah, well, you should tell me before you turn it on. I haven't turned it on yet. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Right, just to let you know. Thank you. You okay? Thank you very much. And I'm recording for my safety. Your safety? Yes, my safety. What do you think I'm going to do to you? Just I don't know. Alfie, am I violent? I don't know you do. But was I violent to you the other day? No. But Have you ever like... seen any videos of me being violent? <coughs> but I've seen loads of uh, videos of you guys being violent. Can I look at your SIA badge, please? I don't have to you, mate. You showed it the other day, Alfie. Yeah, I know. Just... You're not showing it today? Just because of all of what's going on. What's like... going on? The confusions and there's no so confusions anymore, if you're protecting a person you don't have to once you're protecting a vehicle you have to show it so you're not prepared to show your badge who sold you that it's got a hole on the blood go on your sia website mate oh, yeah. and so you know i'm telling you will you show me your badge or are you going to be like elfie don't be like elfie i'm not asking to see your name just your number and the date are you prepared to show your SIA badge? This guy said no, but he's got a lovely pair of earrings. Blimey, you look ever so sweet. Anyway, let's go block the vehicle. That's what I'm here for. There we go. Another scam van blocked, eh, Alfie? Eh? Yeah, another one done. Another one done. I know. Did you speak to my mate Phil this morning? Your, uh, your boots yeah, yeah, nobody's going to steal from me. Except you two. <laughs> you're the thieves. We ain't going to steal from you. Well, mate. you're stealing from the local people. Of course you are. You, you're allowing this van to be here. Which is stealing money. It's a law for that van to be there. Huh? What law? We never voted for it. No. We never voted for it. He, he's, he's admitted that all the figures were altered for him to get this into place. <coughs> he cheated, but that's what the mayor's like. He's a dictating scumbag. That's let it play out lawfully then, won't it? It will, mate, it will. And the next, and this will affect you in the future. When it's a pound a mile, you'll be moaning then, you'll be crying when they go to a pound a mile. So that's the next step. Oh, this guy just got out of bed. Look, there was a sleep in the van when I turned up. You had to wake him up. Alfie had to wake him up. They were sleeping. They soon jumped out when they saw me coming. And on came the camera. Oh, this one's got an injury. Look, he's got a bad knee. Must have been for hurting protesters. Kicking protesters or something. And he turned it on because he was frightened for his life. Yeah, I've never assaulted anybody. Hello, madam. How you doing? I would love a coffee. If you've got sweeteners, I'd have two. Just one spoonful of sugar then, please. White, please. Thank you very much. I really appreciate it. Thank you. See, a local resident supporting what we do. And obviously, she never offered these scumbags a coffee. But just me. I wonder why that was, eh, Alfie? Eh? I told you local people don't want you here. Some people give us a coffee. Yeah, well, they're soft, mate. But the tide is changing on that. The tide is changing. Because if you were, I'm not, never nice to you guys, and especially you again, after you told me you ain't coming back. Right? Yeah, them old ladies the other day might have given you a coffee, mate, but I'm not that, an old lady. You got no coffee on you. 
<laughs> I could easily get you. I could have got you a coffee from that lady if I'd asked for two. But I ain't going to ask for two. And if she did, I hope she would have pissed in it for you. Because <laughs> I'm not an old lady, mate, who thinks you're doing a wonderful job. Because without you scumbags, there'd be no man's here. Hope you're ashamed of yourself. Ex-naval veteran, this one. Served in the Navy. Served in the Navy. And now he's stealing off local people. Alfie the sailor boy. I know Phil had a word with him this morning and told him I'd be coming down. Phil spoke to you, didn't he, this morning, Alfie? Yeah. And he told you I was coming? He told you he was coming. He never told you he was coming. He never told you that I was coming? I wouldn't drive just I wouldn't just drive by Alfie, would I? I don't know if you uh, close to you, I don't know. I wouldn't just drive other. by. I wouldn't just drive by Alfie, don't walk behind me. I'm not behind. I'm, you are, I'm feeling for well if that's not behind me, I don't know what edge I'm feeling for my safety if you not walk behind me. Behind you, don't walk behind me, Alfie, I don't walk behind you. So I don't want one in front and one behind in case one of you attacks me and it's not on camera. Okay? Just let everybody know I'm not suicidal. So if anything happens to me, it's by these two people here. These two retrobates. Guy who's got little earrings, trying to work out. Won't tell me his name. I know Alfie, because Alfie told me the other day that he was gonna, he's a veteran from the Navy and he's gonna stop all this. He agrees that it's not the job he should be in, but he's only just doing it, just doing a little bit of pocket money for Christmas. But now he's changed. Showed me a little video of his girlfriend. Didn't you? No? You didn't show me your girlfriend? Where did your girlfriend live? Where did she live, Alfie? Don't you remember? You showed me a little video of your girlfriend. Where you're emigrating to? You remember now, don't you? Emigrating? Yeah. I ain't emigrating, no. Yeah, of course you're not. Not what you told me the other day, Alfie. He's had enough of this country, said so he wants to get out of here, and now he's changing his mind. Hello, mate, how are you? The lady's just bringing the coffee out, so when she comes, do you want one? Oh, I want one. She's, this house here. She's a bit of a quiet spot, isn't it? I don't know why they come here. I think they just do, just to draw us off, so. <laughs> All right, sorry, there's two of us now. <laughs> Can I just lean this against your fence? Is that all right? No, don't, don't apologise to them because they've been quite nasty. Ah. How are you doing? I'm Good sorry day. this is outside your house, but we'll no, try. It's been a while. I'm just kind of getting used to it. Yeah, though. yeah. I got, I got notified about an hour ago that I was busy. And they knew I was coming down and they don't particularly like me because I'm the gobby they one. They either come around three. Yeah, because they move, they move from place to place. Three, so. but, um, you, you don't mind being on camera, do you? Yeah, I'm not going to film. You don't mind being on film, do you? Oh, no, no. I no. caught you on film when you came to the door, so. That's fine. I won't get you on purpose unless you want me to, but. It's this... not going to one. Did you want a coffee? I'd love a cup of tea. Oh, there you go. Look, look how nice milk, this lady is. She don't milk. want these scumbags around here yeah, either. Two big sugars, please. Twice a day, she reckons they come either in the mornings or in the afternoon. Oh. I've been down um, the other place, it's Hidcup, but uh, the van was there and cleared off. Where in hot, where water, water, water. It was, it was there. I'm not sure why they go there now because there's a camera at the top of the road now. Well, Oh, was it, is it down already? Yeah, come down next day. <laughs> well, that was these cameras cost to go up, you know. I think mean, they're down. Well done, the Blade Runners. I'm not, of course, I'm not condoning it. I'm not condoning these cameras getting chopped down or stickers being put on the on the lenses. But interesting. It's very interesting to see it though. It's good social justice, but I'm not approving it. Vans might oh. be more of a problem for them because I'm told they've only got eight windscreens in it. Oh, only eight windscreens left? Yeah. Oh, I'm sure China can knock out some more. It's not worth even blocking at the moment because nobody's coming. Oh, I don't know about that one. 
We should have blocked him, really. Who? The other guy, a young fella. What's a bit like him? Oh, Phil? Is it true? It might be, yeah. yeah. You're very kind. Look, matching mugs as well, look. Yeah, wow. <laughs> You're a team. <laughs> Thank you. We are a team. And the, we got 20 odd thousand as a team on our group at the moment, and it's getting bigger. And uh, I've been posting a few times. Excellent. It's not always. And we always do this one last because it's quiet. So if we're in busier areas, yeah. we we always go there first. But I think my car is the most skilled car, actually. Yeah. <laughs> but see, Elfie, the ex-sailor boy, was told I'm coming to see him today because he told me the other day he's giving this up. It wasn't a moral job to do, but obviously he's changed his mind. And you, Elfie, <coughs> hey, the 220 quid a day got you in the end. Don't worry about the local people. He said the local people love him. I no, they don't. That's what the Nazis said. I'm totally against that phrase. They have to earn a living. There's lots of other jobs they can do. I'd rather pick up dog shit off the road with my bare hands than do this job. So I don't ever, ever listen to that. They've got to earn a living. We've all got to earn a living, but we're all not doing this job. So I, I've got to disagree with you on that one. But friendly disagreement. But... They haven't got to do this. There's other jobs, but they're greed, you see. Why do you think they're getting paid 220 quid a day? I got one of these sat the other day. I heard, I heard him tell his mate. I need to go back to my job now. Okay. <laughs> if we're here for lunch, we could get a bacon sand sandwich, I reckon. <laughs> huh? <laughs> yeah, you bet. I never thought yeah. that See, I never agree with that. They they got to earn a living. Because me and you could be doing that if you, you wanted to earn a living. But I would rather pick up dog shit with my bare hands than do this. What dog shit? Good. If you've got a yeah, that's the best place for it. Did you see Matt get nicked the other day? I did, and I saw him having that that was mine, punch up yesterday morning, wasn't it? Was it yesterday morning? Right, he had, he had about five of them having a go at him. No, I haven't seen that one. Oh, haven't you? No, that's nasty. Yeah. I haven't seen that. Where was that then? I know, yeah, that's a... I, love, I, just come his, I saw him with the police lady with the BMW. Yeah. No, no, it's not that. It's a really, really nasty. In fact, it got to the stage where he had to do that with one bloke's face. Good. So he hit the others, pushing them away from coming into his space. So he hit them and pushed them Was he on his own then? Well... You couldn't hear anyone behind you. It's unusual for him, because normally his, his yeah. guys jump in behind him. Well, yeah, but there was no, I couldn't hear any noise behind him. So it looked, it sounded like the only one. So here we are, guys, on NV21 Yankee Whiskey Hotel, another Chinese van. Just been told that there's only eight window screens left. That's all they've got left to replace these. Let's check this one out. Oh, warning. This vehicle is equipped with GPS mobile tracking. Who would nick a Chinese van? Oh, the other thing I'm told is if you get a nice heavy hammer and hit them there, yeah. they can't repair it. They can't repair it? No. Oh. Yeah, I'm not one for causing damage to vehicles though. That's not, that's not me. There's the old VIN number there, look. There we go. Okay, look. I wonder what all that was poured on there. But it's turned that plastic all a different horrible colour, hasn't it? No, I don't know what was being poured on there. I don't know. It's discoloured all that plastic. Mm. These vans never get cleaned. You know how dirty these TFL vans are. They're just filthy. Mind you, filthy people driving them, I suppose. I'm just going to put this cup back on this lady's deck. Uh, so I'm not holding it all the time. Thank you very much. That was beautiful coffee. I think if I stick it there, it'll be safe. 